Yeah, 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 I know, I know. So we got a classic Xeno match. I mean, we haven't seen this in a long time, but back in the day, we used to see this all the time at Xeno. Nixie oh, yeah, versus free. Venia. Now, this ha this just happened in Winter Semis. Nixie opted to get the win over Venia, and Venia was pissed. He was so mad. <laughs> so let's see if he's going to try to bring this back and get his revenge. He didn't the grudge match. that mad, but, I mean... You know, you gotta keep up he was appearances like, until you're off the stage. He so was like joking, like, mad. You know, he, right, he, right, yeah, right. He, he was just like, uh, how did your percent go? He's like, he lost. Yeah. I'm pissed. You of know? course, these two with an immense amount of respect for each other, though. Mm -hmm. I mean, both players of rare characters, even in Smash Four. I would say Falcon was a little bit on the rare side toward the end of the game. Everybody playing him at the beginning, but mm -hmm. um, that didn't last. But it did for Nick C and Venia, kind of telling the opposite tale, right? Of a character who was very, very underplayed in Smash Four and now is super good. So they still, both still underplayed in this game, in my opinion. Yeah, still underplayed for how good he is. Absolutely, he's kind of tricky, so I'm not that surprised. But I mean, Greninja is amazing in Ultimate. Falcon is hot fucking trash. If I'm gonna be real. Come so, on, man, he's in top three. Let him yeah, run. That's what I'm saying. Like Nick what? has Nick has been immune to the nerfs. I'm oh, sorry, that was sick. All right, what are you Falcon doing? kick. Jeez. Nick. This, dude, who let this guy play? Like, who let him in here? Who invited this he guy? He just pushes the B button, and it works. B button with Falcon, man. If we could see all four B moves in one match, I'll lose my mind. I have never seen Nixie use Falcon Punch in my life. Really? I've never seen him do it. I'm sure he's landed one before in Tourney. I've never oh, seen no, him dude, do it. No, dude, you've seen his pin tweet, though. The blindfolded combos. Oh, right, right, yeah, but that. Yeah, yeah, so technically you have, but yeah, not in a match. Either way, Benia, all of a sudden, right back in. I mean, he was in control for most of the game, but now... Now he is again. Okay, Nick yep. C just popped off for a second, but Venia's like, hold up. I'm awake now. I mean, both these players are just so momentum-based. Like, they just go back and forth and just annihilate stocks. This is yeah. going to be a fast-paced match. Yeah, I've seen them zero to death. Plenty of opponents, including each other. He was trying to go for that back here right after that hop. He, he has his double anyway. jump. No, he doesn't. Oh, he lost it? Yeah. And he misses the ledge. Good right. edge guard coming out from Venia. Yeah, the hydro pump coming in last he second. He just spawned <laughs> and he did that. He just, he just spawned in. Did he just spawn in slowly and down smash? I'm so mad. All right. Nick looking for the untackable with the back air. I like that attempt, but man, just not enough. And the dash attack of all things is going to be what seals the deal on Venia's second stock here. All right, down to the wire in game one. This means a lot. If we see a fifth game, you know, it's going to determine whose terms the set is played on. Max, I don't know who's taking this set, dog. I, I literally have no I idea. I couldn't tell you, man. I mean, it was a 3-2 super close set in winner's bracket. You see Nick at Rock Croc there, the tech on the wall into the punish on Falcon Dive. That up smash just in case he wanted to chill there and go tech in place. Good tech away from Venia to avoid that setup. But Nick could have easily held that. He landed out the back air to push Nick C towards the corner. He's got stage Ooh. control, sets him up nicely. He uses his double jump early to recover high. The weak nuke into F smash was Really good. Oh, down air? Outer hit of down air. And now Venia in a position where he might die. Nick is just so ah! scary off the stage. Oh! oh, he got it. He just ran off and did it. Down air. Now, I got to say, I, I appreciate how Nick plays with no headphones, man. Not only is that a sign of confidence in your gameplay, like, oh, I don't even need to hear the audio. Like, I'll just react visually. But, dude, it means he knows the crowd fucks with him. Because if they didn't, he wouldn't want to hear them. And Nick, Benia, I mean, explode. I feel like Benny is a dude who's totally comfortable with hearing people talk in the background or whatever. But against Nick C, you're playing a dangerous game, not putting that headset on because they're gonna be going nuts for your opponent. Bro, I need to hear that sound, man. I don't know how he does same, it. Same, same, same. I absolutely need to do it. Even if the whole crowd's on my side, I don't care. Right. I need to hear the game, or else I'm gonna get you know C board or just hit with anything. Yeah, imagine playing against Snake with no sound. Yeah, that sounds like a nightmare. It should be illegal. <laughs> Here we go, game number two. Venny with the counter pick. Let's see if he can bring this back. I, I would not be shocked, like you said earlier, if this goes to game five. Like I, not shocked in the least. But Nick C turns a bad situation into a good one early up. Even Venny, he knew Nick C was fishing for that back air down below. Oh, oh geez. my lord! He set him up for the spike on stage, almost off stage. That'd have been McNasty, bro. <laughs> really, Nick Nasty, dude. That should be this guy's name. Oh, okay. okay that's fine. Th yeah. th that's classic down the tilt. Dodge out, yeah. Yep. Yeah, you know you're going to try to bash on that just in case he messes up his timing a little bit on the fair or the up smash that normally follows that. And Venia's looking to take advantage of that, man. Get in your head. Make you think about Oh! Venia. I mean, it's not a tournament with Venia if he doesn't SD trying to go for a downer. Like, it happens at least once. You give him everyone once. 
You see he's got a smile on his face, but man, that might be masking how much he is upset about that, honestly. Like, he lost the last game by the skin of his teeth. He knows what he's gambling when he does that stuff. It's true. Risk management, man. You gotta always accept the consequences if he, you're not gonna land that. He tends to go for it when he has a stock lead, too. So it's like, he, he doesn't feel like, okay, whatever, I was at high percent. Yeah, I'm, st I'm still winning. No big deal. It would have been sick yeah. if I landed it. Risk management. All right. Oh, gets the whiff down air. Nick looking for the air dodge punish of his own. I like the dash dance to bait out the uh, option. Sets him up nicely with the dash attack. Nixie baiting out where he was going to land using the double jump last second. Meets him in the air with up air. Oh, what? The late hit on that. Somehow connecting with Greninja. We were talking about how Falcon struggles against all Mars size. I mean, Greninja's a little bit bigger, but the way he stands is so low to the ground that you can see similar problems come into play. He's got to have back problems. What? Gets the kill. Jeez, dude. Nick setting him up insanely nicely, and all of a sudden, Nick has a lead. Let's see if any can try to close out the stock as fast as possible before Nick gets any more momentum onto the set. Yeah, it just feels like Venia is winning most of the interactions, or at least a good bit of them. Especially over time, he's the one pulling ahead first, but Nick is so good at finding a way to take that stock away, and of course, you can build all the percent you want, man. Smash is a game of stocks. It's the only way to win. There we go. Nick gets hit by the forward air. Still alive. He's living the dream, bro. That might be the longest I've ever seen somebody live Greninja's fair. <laughs> Dead center with a heavy character like Falcon, though. I mean, I'm not too surprised by that. He oh, right the, the fuck through the air dodge, bro. What? He ate the double jump. That was... Okay, Nick, you got it, bro. All right. That entire, that edge guard is because he set him up nicely by e Dude. forcing out the early double jump, set him up into the knee, got the sweet spot off of it raw. Nick no C, combos bro. necessary. No combos necessary. The C stands for gaming. This guy's That doesn't unreal. remotely make any sense, Max. That's what it stands for, right? I don't make the rules. Uh, I just abide I by them. I think you do. I, think I just you do. abide by them. <laughs> Okay, game three. here it is, game three, Nixie up two over Venia. I mean, you're a PR man, might have to make a little bit of an adjustment after this event. Jersey PR certainly does, I'll tell you that much. Right. Biddy's jumping on that Biddy list. number one. Oh. Okay. The up airs and no jump. Oh, wow, that may have worked in another universe, and I'm not living anymore in that universe, so I'm very glad. We're in beta, <laughs> it bro. It wasn't this one. Oh. Yo, Nick, so smart, hedging his bets on that edge guard there. He could have gone for it all, but it wouldn't have worked and may have resulted in him dying. Okay, big punish from Venium. He tried to set him up with the dash attack, just to, like set him up for like a combo right afterwards, but that's another time when he went for that as a punish and couldn't get something set up. Nick C just chipping away here, not really looking for huge moves. Back air, yeah, it'll probably kill. Maybe not from center stage, but it's very safe, so you can kind of feel free to throw that one out a bit. Just hard to hit Greninja, man, when he's on the ground like that. Low Nair. Takes a lot of time to set up. Oh, wow. And he's DIing in, trying to get back to the stage. He's going to give him the wrong DI on Nixie's dash attack. Send him right off the top. Gives him the old shoulder tackle for an anti-air option. Can't right. work out. Downer. Oh, couldn't get the second bear. Venia with the Phantom puts a lot of trouble. I love that. Trying to fall with Nick. Rise with him as well. He thought he was going to go low. Venia was right there ready for it. No tech. Oh. Sets him up nicely. Try to go for a grab. Yeah, he was behind him, though. Yep. Benny just holding in desperately, you could tell. Oh, the Tomahawk grab, though. Where are you going? He did two empty short hops. Such a good edge guard, or, or ledge trap, rather. Saying, you know what, man? I'm looking for an aerial. You better do regular get up and shield. Don't jump. Right. Now, Venia, he wants that down tilt so badly. Give him a little chop on the shins. Side B, gonna push him, but get him, do some pressure relief. And he's also got that up B command grab, you know, right? If he does that at a shield, oh. it's tough. Venia tried to stall for as long as possible before committing that up B, but all I did was give Nixie time to set up exactly. for the spike. Exactly. He was trying to throw his timing off, man, but it just didn't work out. I thought he was gonna go for a second there. I thought he was gonna do it. Nick is crazy, man. If there was anyone who was gonna do it, it would be him, but all right. There we go, Venia putting something up, putting up a fight. I wanna see this. Trying to avoid this 3-0 at all costs here. I mean, Venia has made it so deep into this bracket. Top rapid three. jab? I've never seen Venia use rapid jab. That's crazy. Yeah, I mean, I feel like he just gets it if he messed up the input for gentlemen. Oh, yeah. Nick, I thought there was a knee coming after that, bro. You need to slow down. Right, hey, up there, another. Not gonna let him land. What's crazy is I could still see Venia turning this one around. Okay, he's gonna scout out the landing option from Nick. He knows that when Nick sees like like this and has this, is feeling himself this much, he's gonna go for crazy ass options, and Venia's gonna capitalize on that. All the way at the top. 
Hold on a second. This isn't guaranteed for Nixie just yet. Benny had already deleting two stocks in a time frame of like a minute. Benny with some crazy okay. comeback back there, but Nick, rock solid. Not going to let it happen to him. He has been the one to make those crazy comebacks in so many situations. He knows what it feels like, man. He's like, I just got to stifle this guy before he gets going. And he does just that. The down here through the stage, man. Twice in a row on that up B. He beat him in winner semis and he beat him in losers finals. Yeah, two Three sets in a row. Zero. Right. It was game five the first time. It was like yeah. super, super close. But Do you think there was like...